So far, Nairobi City County government has screened more than 12,000 individuals in efforts to curb the spread of the virus. Testing was launched last week along with a fumigation exercise across the country that has seen 12,590 individuals screened, among them 5,100 adults, 5,515 children, and 3,477 youths with only two individuals having elevated temperatures. Among the areas that were fumigated in the Nairobi CBD are General Post Office, GPO, public resting areas around the Hilton Hotel, Kencom Bus Stage, Aga Khan Walk and the expansive Gikomba Market. Other places include Koja Stage, City Market, National Archives, Jivanji Gardens, Hakati Road, Tomboya Street, Muthura Market, Ronald Ngala Street and Mfangano Lane. Nairobi County Health Executive Hitan Majevdia said that the focus this week will be on the city's main bus station as well as the railways Matatu and train Tamini where screening and fumigation will be carried out for the next four days up to Friday, March 27th. 215 county health officers are involved in the fumigation which targets public resting furniture, bus stops, markets and other areas with large social gatherings. The county has further made available 13 ambulances for use to transport any suspected case to the quarantine center at Mbagathi Hospital. Seven of the ambulances are at Kibera South Health Center, Matare Hospital, Mukuru Health Center, Mutuini Hospital, Pumwani Hospital, Kahawa West and Andorra 2 Health Center. In addition, a rapid response team has been put in place to actively coordinate response to the coronavirus pandemic. So far, the county has trained 675 healthcare workers from 200 health facilities, both public and private, with a plan to have 3,000 healthcare workers trained. The health CEC further said they have also trained all county and sub-county health managers who are currently rolling out and supervising health facilities, as well as offering community level training.